Who's gonna be the DCU Batman? Everyone wants to know. Is it gonna be Jensen Ackles? Is it gonna be Alan Richardson? Is it gonna be your mom? Who is it gonna be? Well, remember that dude, Charles Murphy, who broke the internet, kind of, where he shared some information about, you know, casting calls being out in the open for the DCU Batman. Well, he came back on Twitter and said this. A fan asked him a question. Hey, any potential candidates? And he says, uh, when I first shared the news, the casting call had not been shared with agencies yet. They were expecting it to come soon. So no. So I'm like, OK, the you know, information is going to come out soon about what James Gunn and Peter Saffron are looking for when it comes to their Bruce Wayne, like the, the actor, like the age range and, and whether it's going to be a big star or an unknown name. And I'm like, oh, my God, here we go, baby. Finally, like we are getting we are getting closer and closer to who's going to be the DCU Batman. We're going to see Batman and Robin kicking ass probably 2027. So I'm like, oh, shit, here we go. Oh, shit, what the fuck is this? Hold up, wait a minute. Spoiler alert. We got to put this shit on pause because James Gunn recently came on Blue Sky social media and said this. A fan asked him, is it true that a new actor is about to be cast for Batman? How are they going? And James Gunn says, I keep getting this question. Don't know where it's coming from, but... Wherever it is, it's totally false. We don't have a script yet. Oh, let's see. Outright. Missed. Missed. Woo. Missed. Much like my HIV test, this one came out negative. So it seems like Charles Murphy just wasted everyone's time being a cloud chaser. I hope you stub your big toe on the big Lego playset, you piece of filth. So again, now we just have to be patient and just wait for the DCU Batman, which I'm sure is on the docket. I'm sure James Gunn has a, a whiteboard in his room and they're connecting all the dots to make sure everything is in place. And, you know, we as fans are impatient because we want to see Batman and Robin kicking ass on screen. We are curious to see what James Gunn and Peter Saffron are looking for in their Bruce Wayne. Uh, I don't know if they're looking for an older actor, a younger actor, similar age range to David Cornsweet. We don't know what the costume looks like. We don't know what uh, uh, casting uh, casting calls for little Damien Wayne. Are, are, are they going to cast like a 10 year old Damien Wayne? Are they going to cast a kid who's in who's probably like maybe like 15 or 16? Uh, so many questions, so many answers. But again, we just have to be patient and see what James Gunn and, and Andy Mushishisha have in store for us. Again, it's uh, it's a delicate film that that they have to balance because not only are they kind of competing with themselves with Matt Reeves the Batman but they also want to make sure that this version this iteration of the DCU Batman is not as dark as the Matt Reeves one and they have to be careful they don't tread into the Joel Schumacher territory where it's way too silly way too goofy they need to find a delicate balance and, and that tightrope is going to be uh it's going to be tricky but again I have faith in Andy and James to deliver something that's truly unique and something that we haven't seen before within the DC universe as a whole. So, have faith. Have faith. So, that's going to be it. Hit like, subscribe, follow me on Twitter, Instagram, Discord, TikTok, and Sisters at Shakes. Leave me in the comments below. What do you think of all this news? And as always, truth out. Black Adam? Yep. Cool. Dwayne. Nobody likes it. Nope.